ஸ்ரீ குருபிய நமக்கா சில்ட்ரன் ஹேம் ஹாப்பி டு வெல்கம் யூ ஆல் ஃபார் அவர் ஆன்லைன் டீச்சிங் அகாடமி ஏக்கலைவா ஃபார் த கிளாஸ் டுவெல் சப்ஜெக்ட் பயாலஜி சாப்டர் ஃபோர் பிரின்சிபல்ஸ் ஆஃப் இன்ஹெரிட்டன்ஸ் அண்ட் வேரியேஷன்ஸ் டுடே வி ஆர் கோயிங் டு டிஸ்கஸ் அபவுட் எ நியூ டாபிக் that is genetic disorders a genetic disorder is a disease so disorder is nothing but disease or a syndrome that is caused by abnormality in an individual dna if any damage takes place in the nucleotide sequence or any problem happens in the individual dna that leads to genetic disorder okay so abnormalities can range from a small mutation in a single gene to the addition or subtraction of an entire chromosome or entire even a set of chromosomes these are all the abnormalities abnormalities ranges from starts from a small mutation of a single gene or it may happens in the entire chromosomes the genetic disorders are of two types one is mendelian disorders and another one is chromosomal disorders mendelian disorder is nothing but the disorder or uh, damage or abnormality takes place in a single gene okay first we will see the mendelian disorders alteration or mutation you know very well uh, you already studied about the mutation what is mutation a sudden change or sudden alteration or sudden damage takes place in the nucleotide sequence of the individual dna or the gene that is called the mutation okay so alteration or mutation in a single gene causes mendelian disorder as i said mendelian disorder is nothing but a small alteration or changes takes place in a single gene these disorders are transmitted Uh, to the offspring on the same line as the mendelian pattern of inheritance some of the examples of mendelian disorders are the first one is thalassemia second one albinism third one phenylketonuria fourth one sickle cell anemia and last one is hashington corey these are the some of the examples of mendelian disorders all these are the examples of disorders Repe- i am repeating once again the first one is thalassemia second one is albinism third one is phenylketonuria fourth one is sickle cell anemia and the last one is hashington corey so these disorders may be dominant or recessive and autosome autosomal or sex linked okay among these example we will see the first one thalassemia thalassemia is a what is thalassemia it is a disorder mendelian disorder okay so thalassemia is an autosomal recessive disorder autosomes so 23 among the 23 pairs 22 pairs are autosomes okay so this type of disorder is uh, comes under autosomal recessive disorder it is caused by gene mutation resulting in excessive destruction of rbc the so destruction of rbc damage of rbc takes place due to the formation of abnormal hemoglobin molecules see the picture here and uh, this is a normal blood cells having w rbc wbc platelets these are the blood cells so during in the thalassemia condition thalassemia the destruction the shape of the rbcs are damaged okay so this is mainly caused due to the gene mutation resulting in the excessive destruction of rbc so destruction of rbc leads to thalassemia normally hemoglobin is composed of four polypeptide chains two alpha chain and two beta globulin chains so hemoglobin made up of are composed of four chain two alpha and two beta globulin thalassemia patients have a defect in either the alpha chain or beta globulin 
causing the production of abnormal hemoglobin molecules resulting in anemia. Thalassemia is classified into <coughs> alpha and beta based on which the chain of hemoglobin molecule is affected. As I said, hemoglobin have two chain, two alpha and two beta. Okay. It is controlled by, this is controlled by two closely linked genes. One is H hemoglobin A1 and another one is hemoglobin A2 on chromosome number 16. So, first to pair to six, uh, 22 pairs, all are autosomes, they are the body chromosomes. Here the defect takes place in the 16th pair. Okay. So, mutation or deletion of one or more of the four alpha gene allele causes alpha thalassemia. In beta thalassemia, the production of beta globin chain is affected. It is controlled by a single gene. HBB on chromosome number 11. The second example, phenylketonuria. It is an inborn error of phenylalanine metabolism caused due to a pair of autosomal recessive gene. It is also a formed caused due to the pair of autosomal recessive genes. See the picture here, phenylalanine, that is um, necessary for the formation of thiosin. Okay. So, it is caused due to mutation in the gene PH, PAH, that is phenylalanine hydroxylase gene. So, this particular disorder is mainly caused due to a mutation takes place in gene PAH phenylalanine hydroxylase gene. This particular gene is located on the chromosome number 12. So, this gene, what type of gene? PAH, phenylalanine hydroxylase gene, hydroxylase gene, especially located in the chromosome number 12 for the hepatic enzyme. So, this gene necessary for the formation of enzyme phenylalanine hydroxylase. Okay. This enzyme is essential for the conversion of phenylalanine into tyrosine. So, PH this enzyme phenylalanine hydroxylase is necessary for the conversion of phenylalanine into tyrosine. Affected individual lacks this enzyme. If the person has disorder phenylketonuria, there is no enzyme production. What type of enzyme? Phenylalanine hydroxylase enzyme lacks this enzyme. So, phenylalanine accumulates and gets converted to phenylpyruvic acid and other phenylpyruvic acid and phenyl lactic acid and other some derivatives. It is characterized by severe mental retardation, light pigmentation of skin and air. Phenylpyruvic acid is excreted in the urine also. Then third one is albinism. <coughs> albinism is an inborn error of metabolism caused due to an autosomal recessive gene. Melanin pigment is responsible for skin color. Okay, Melanin is very important. Melanin pigment is responsible for the skin color. Absence of melanin results in the condition called albinism. So, during the uh, in the albinism patients, the melanin pigment is absent. There is no melanin pigment. So, melanin is very essential or uh, necessary for the skin color. A person with the recessive allele lacks tyrosinase enzyme, which is required for the conversion of dihydrophenylalanin into melanin inside the melanocytes. So, 3,4 dihydroxy phenylalanine also called as DOPA, DOPA by the enzyme tyrosinase. This tyrosinase enzyme acted on DOPA and it converts into melanin. If the gene is defect, a person having recessive allele lacks this enzyme, tyrosinase enzyme. 
So there is no dopa conversion into melanin. So absence of melanin leads to the skin color. So condition called albinism. In albinism or albino, melanocytes are present in the normal number and in their skins, skin, air and iris etc. but lack melanin pigment. See the picture of albinism, albin present. The next one is, the last one, Hashington Kore. It is inherited as an autosomal dominant lethal gene in man. It is characterized by involuntary jerking of the body and progressive degeneration of the nervous system accompanied by gradual mental and physical deteriorations. The patients with this disorder, the patient with this disease usually die between the age of 35 to 40. Thank you children to receive our online lessons. Please press subscribe button and you will receive the latest updates.